My name is Chris Dupont. I'm an associate professor here in the Environmental and Microbial Genomics Group at the J. Craig Venter Institute in La Jolla. As has been uh, noted in the news quite frequently, there is a large amount of plastic that is ending up on our beaches and our waterways and then further down into the ocean. And uh, ourselves, along with our collaborators, uh, flipped this question and asked, does this pollution actually provide a new habitat for microbes in the ocean that's different than the rest of the ocean. So the idea was to look at what microbes are found on marine plastics, if there are microbes found on marine plastics, how those compare to the microbes found in the surrounding seawater. Are they the same? Are they different? Um, and finally, we were interested in looking at the potential that these microbes might actually be degrading the plastics. Obviously a moonshot would be understanding, to identifying and domesticating biochemical pathways for degrading plastics into monomers and deploying this in an industrial setting. Essentially by improving our land-based recycling pipelines to prevent plastics from ever entering the waste stream and into the ocean. That would be essentially the moonshot, but even understanding do these plastics harbor different microbes, do they change the ecology of the ocean as a whole by providing a different habitat? And further, do these plastics provide a safe harbor for potential pathogens?